20 games into the season, how would you assess your game this year versus last year? Uh, well, I mean, obviously off to a pretty good start. Um, just feel a lot more comfortable this season. Um, feel like I've kind of found found a pretty good role and um, happy with where my game's at. But uh, in saying that, I want to continue to keep pushing. I want to get better here, um, keep growing on my game. I, there's lots of areas that I can continue to work on. And um, just, uh, yeah, obviously last year was, was one to kind of forget and um, move past. And uh, I feel like I've done a good job at uh, kind of coming into this season with a different mindset. And uh, it's been working so far. Do you feel motivated either by how you played last year or by some of the things that were came out in the summer, you know, the trade rumors, all that stuff. What was the, the motivation, you know, to come to camp? Was it internal? Was it external? Was it a combination of both? Yeah, probably a combination of, of a lot of things. I mean, first and foremost, just not, not happy at all with how my season went. So motivation coming off of that um, was probably where it started. And um, obviously you add on uh, other elements throughout the, the course of, of an off season and uh, coming into this season. Um, you know, more of an opportunity, bigger role, and um, just lots of reasons to, to get motivated. So, um, you know, I'm happy that I did, and uh, it's been it's been uh, good so far. Torres mentioned that you know the, the mistake in the Rangers game. You just came back to the bench and you just took your next shift and, and just were able to move on. Is that something that maybe earlier in your career you might have dwelled on throughout the course of a game, and you, know, you can kind of quickly get past that? Yeah. Um, I mean, not not too sure I, I was uh, willing to go back to that same play in that game. But uh, as for my game itself, yeah, it's you know, um, you know I mentioned it the night of the game. Uh, it's a play I make regularly. Uh, it's unfortunate the outcome of it, um, but yeah, I obviously had to move past it. I, you know, I'm playing a lot of minutes right now, and um, you know, you just got to go and take your next shift and try to find a way to, to help it, help your team get back in that game. And um, you know, I wish I could have, you know, done a little bit more that night. Kind of changing gears real quick, looking at more of a team thing, uh, the penalty kill. Last year, you guys scored a lot of shorthanded goals, same as this year, um, but you gave up a lot too. You gave up a lot, a lot of a lot of goals, a lot of chances, whatnot. This year, you guys have continued to, to be a threat shorthanded, but it seems like you've really tightened up in terms of what you've allowed. I guess what, what changes, you know, have happened for, from last year to this year to allow you guys to be better defensively on the penalty kill? Um. Well, I think as a group, we seem to be uh, the guys that are going seem to be working well together. Um, you know, when there's a breakdown, other guys are are helping out, bailing guys out. Um, you know, maybe it's just another year in in Shazi's system, and um, you know, getting more comfortable in, in what his expectations are. And um, but I think the biggest thing is, yeah, we're just we're going out there, uh, reacting to the situation, um, and we feel we feel comfortable that we can kill um, against the best power plays in the league. Uh, I don't know. It just it, it, you know. I think uh, with with different things that that went on, um, I think it was pretty easy to come in and um, not really have any any pressure or worry about um, certain things and just go out and play. Um, that was kind of the biggest thing for me. Was uh, you know, you're, you're a pretty good hockey player. Uh, go out and and do what you do best. You're up six minutes a game from last season. This season, obviously. Second in the league at 26 minutes per game tells you everything you need to know about what the coaches think of you in your play. But how much, how does that relationship sort of developed and, and changed maybe with Torts, with our people in the organization since last season ended to where you're able to be trusted in this role to have this much ice time in all situations? Um, yeah, I think it's just uh, uh, some of the work that I put in to, to be able to have that bigger role. Um, and uh, I mean, it's something that I've had in the past. Um, you know, I've played a lot of minutes in, at different levels, and uh, even at this level, I, I've you know, throughout my career, played uh, you know quite a bit of minutes. So um, I feel comfortable in that situation. I, I tend to to get into the game and, and uh, you know, more involved when I am playing more minutes. So um, you know, it's been nice to to have that expanded role. And um, like I said, I want to continue to grow and get better and um, keep providing for for this team. But as far as a relationship 
earning that trust? Like, is it different now when you have a conversation with either it's Torch or Bradshaw or whomever? They know you a little better. You know them a little bit better. The expectations, the understanding has changed from last season? Um, I'm not too sure. Maybe you can expand on that. Well, okay, so, you know, he's a different kind of coach than maybe you've had in the past, and the relationship is – what it is, but now you have a year of experience knowing him, he has a year of experience knowing you. Is it different in that way where you guys have sort of met in the middle a little bit as far as expectations, how you have to play for him and how what he can say to you? Yeah, I think I, I think obviously our relationship has grown. I think um, we do have a better understanding of each other and I think that's helped a, a lot um, this season. I think we've um, been able to, to work well together and. Um, like you said, he can he can trust uh, that I'm going to go out and do the job, and, and vice versa uh, on my end. And um, just as you know, same thing when I make those mistakes, uh, he can trust that I'm going to go out and respond and, and uh, provide um, you know good minutes after that, which is you know I think something that you know he wanted to see more of last season, and um, I think I've done a good job of responding to that.